It's hard to imagine our world running out of sand when we have deserts like the Sahara. But desert sand, with its smooth, rounded grains shaped by wind, is useless in construction. It's like trying to build with marbles. Instead, the world's insatiable need for concrete buildings, bridges and motorways demands sand from rivers and coastlines which has angular grains that lock together like a jigsaw puzzle. And this usable sand is running out. When too much is taken, a chain reaction is set off, leading to severe floods and erosion, and making us more vulnerable to nature's forces. Sand's versatility as a building material was understood by the Romans. They figured out how to mix sand with lime and volcanic ash to create concrete, an invention that's literally stood the test of time. Today, concrete is the most common building material on the planet. If it were a country, it would rank among the world's top carbon emitters. If we were to embrace more sustainable building practices based on local materials and conditions, sand could be preserved for essential purposes and protected from over-extraction. So the next time you're walking on a beach, take a moment to feel the sand under your feet. It's a mirror of the Earth's history that takes thousands, if not millions, of years to form. These tiny grains of sand are our history, sure, but they're also our future.